In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a thumbnail for your videos, or for anything for that matter. But what I have here is a video, and I just have it open in my browser. It's just a flash video, and I want to make a thumbnail to put on my website. Okay, so what I can do is open a program. We'll call it uh, openpaint.net. You can download it for free. Just do a search on paint.net, download it, and install it. Okay, so here's what paint.net looks like. Now let's go back to our web page here. Now what you want to do is just hit your print screen button. Now what that did is it copied this image into the clipboard. Okay, so what we do now, we go back and we bring up paint.net. Click on edit and click paste. And we want to just keep the canvas the same size. And there is our image. Now Let's just move these out of the way a little bit here. What we're going to want to do now is just trim this so that we only get the part of the image we want in our thumbnail. Okay, so you just click on this thing here. It's a rectangle select. And then select the area you want, just like this. We'll keep it above the play button here. But you can put that in if you want. It's up to you. I'm going to keep it above. And now what we do is do image and then crop to selection. Okay, now we have the image we want in there. Now the next thing you want to do is go back to image and resize. Now you can make the thumb any size you want. So let's say we want it to be 120 wide. As long as we have maintain aspect ratio checked, it will automatically adjust the height. So let's click OK. Okay, and there's our thumb. Of course, you can make it any size you want. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to save it. So let's just do a file, do a save as. Okay, let's save it as a JPEG. And let's just call it, it doesn't matter what you call it. I'm going to just call it vid thumb. Okay, so if you're putting multiple thumbs, on your website you need to have a name there okay so let's do that save that okay now we have to go through here so we we'll click OK here just take the default okay and in our folder here's this thumb so we can click on that and as you see there it is now let's say you want to add it to our website I'm not going to go into too much detail about creating a website but I'm going to open up a web editor called composer here okay so the rest of your web page is here. I'm just going to put my thumb on my web page that already exists. So what I do is I just go to image here and then I select the folder I want. And then I grab the image. And you can put some alternate text in here for search engines. I'm just going to put don't use. Now over here we can go link and here we can link to the video that this is supposed to play. Okay, so there it is. Click OK. Okay, now I'm going to save this and open it up and show you what it does. Okay, so here's the page I just created. Let's click on that. And here is our thumbnail. You notice that when we put a mouse over it, it goes to the little hand here. That means we can click. So I'm going to click on that now. And as you see, it's going to play the Camtasia video. Okay, so that's a quick way that you can create your own thumbs for your vid videos or for any other application. You just need to bring up the image in your browser, hit print and screen, move it into paint.net and edit it and save it. 